This short video will show you how to use the countdown timers produced by Dave Ford and shared by him under the terms and conditions that you can use them within your presentations without attribution. So there's various other details uh, telling you how to use them within his PowerPoint presentation. Uh, basically, they look like buttons and they give you a time. So if you pull up uh, PowerPoint as a full screen and you click on a button, uh, then it will give you a countdown and they range from 10 seconds as we can see here up to uh, five, six minutes. So when it gets to the end, sometimes it makes a noise or just simply does that and it can be useful for managing classroom activities. So let's see how we would copy one of these. The easiest way is to drag so that you make sure you select all of the things here and press Control C to copy it. In a new file, just simply then, if we go to a, a new slide, and we'll just make the this empty to start with, just Control V to paste. When everything's selected, you can still move it around, and you can then, when you go to the slideshow, click on it, and it will count down. So that's for a minute. If we move back to the previous one, and we scroll down, you can see that there are buttons for different colors, there's also sand timers and full minute circles and digital clock time and countdowns. So again, if we wanted the two minute one here, just highlight everything. Control C to copy. We'll go to our site here, paste it in. And then when we go to here, clicking on it, we'll start our countdown to two minutes. Again, just be very careful. If you notice that there's a couple of different elements here, so if you want to move it later, make sure you select everything and then you can pick it up and drag it and move it to a new area within your presentation. Okay, that's it.